Xbox got really, really hot there. It kicked in the freaking hyperdrive to cool itself down. Hi. I've decided tonight that I'm going to play San Andreas. Basically the same thing as I did last time. But Forza Horizon 5 is going to go up before San Andreas. I'm just playing this because... The next part of San Andreas that I have to play here, I'm going to have to grind, and it's going to take quite a while to grind this, unfortunately. I have to basically grind up to a point where I learn up, where I learn enough to where I can do the next story mission, which involves me having to swim in water. So, this is going to be a pretty boring Let's Play of San Andreas, most likely, so I apologize beforehand. Thank you all so much for tuning in. If you decide you want to tune in, watch me basically swim around the whole map the whole video. But hello everyone, Edge Runner Gaming HD. Welcome to another Let's Play of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, where today I learn how to swim. Let me make sure it's recording. Okay, good. I just wanted to make sure that it's recording. My For the Horizon 4 video did save. So thank God for that. From here on out, when it comes to the game DVR, I learned that if I turn my Xbox One all the way off and leave it off for like a minute or two and then boot it right back up and load everything up, give it a little bit of time to load up, eventually... I will be able to use the game DVR most of the time. It will work most of the time. Sometimes, unfortunately, it won't. Like, the other night, I tried to uh, play The Lost and Damned to try to record that, and it saved, but it still gave me a hard time nonetheless. And it's really pissing me off with Xbox because... They can fix this. I know they can fix this issue. It's just they're too fucking lazy to do it because they care more about jacking up Game Pass Ultimate than they do fixing Game DVR. What would you like, sir? Pizza to get my health up. I want the full rack. Pizza. Enjoy, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much for the pizza. Bye-bye. Uh, I got a story mission on the map, but I'm going to learn how to swim. I have to learn how to swim. In. Ow. What am I running in? Well, he must, CJ must be trying to climb. And it's too high for him to climb. Yep, that's why. Alright, use the movement controls to move around in the water. I know how to swim in San Andreas. I played this game probably like a million times. First time I've ever played San Andreas in full on Xbox though. Never played this game on, X on Xbox before until, well, until I started this Let's Play. Until I started this Let's Play series, is what I meant to say. Your breath will decrease while you're underwater. I know. Swim back up to the surface to get your breath back. The breath meter will slowly increase back to its maximum. Alright. Turtle! I see a big old turtle down there. I remember the first time I ever played San Andreas and I had to learn how to swim. I was terrified of going into the water because I used to think there was like sharks and stuff like that that would come out and attack you. And I used to think that if I got near the jellyfish in the game they would electrocute my ass and fry me and kill me. 
But the only thing that'll kill me in the water is if I get shot at. If a boat manages to run me over. Or if I drown. Most likely, most likely case, I drown. Yeah, I'm going to have to do this the whole video, unfortunately. I'm losing fat, though. I'm going to be slim, yet muscular. And it's raining in the game. Lovely. Get back up. Yeah, I told you all that this is going to be a boring video, unfortunately. I might title this video, Don't Watch This Unless You Want to Get Bored. Because this is going to be a pretty boring let's play. But I just figured I'd get it done and over with and get it out of the way. If I can. If I can learn up enough to be able to do the next story mission. Alright. Stamina upgrade. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for a longer. Nice. Stamina is going up. This is the part of San Andreas that I really don't like. And before anybody comes in and says, Oh, just use a cheat code. Cheat the game. I could, but I'd rather play the game fair and square. Now, if I don't have a choice, then yes, I will use a cheat code to learn how to swim. Just to get it out of the fucking way. Because I, I absolutely hate this part. This part's more annoying than doing... Well, I'm not going to spoil that. There's a certain mission coming up later on that's pretty annoying. But I'd rather do that than this. Like, this is... I would say this is the most annoying part of San Andreas for me. Having to learn how to swim just to do, like, a few specific missions. back up. Got quite a bit of weapons here. I got a silencer. Pretty much a map gun. A sniper rifle. Satchel charges. A camera. And my fist. And a police baton. capacity upgrade. You can hold your breath for longer. Good. And it's barely gone up. <laughs> See, I told you this is going to take a while, ladies and gentlemen. One trick I did learn about learning how to swim is if you dive underwater and hold it until you almost run out of breath, it does make your lung capacity go up quite a bit. If I just keep doing this, it'll just keep going up and up and up and up and up. And get near the, the top of the water. There we go. 
Sometimes I unfortunately do fuck this up and I end up drowning. Alright, stamina upgraded. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for longer. Good. Gone up just a itty bitty bit. I pretty much lost all my fat. I'm a skinny boy outside of the muscle. If it wasn't for this muscle, I'd basically be nothing but freaking a skeleton. I'd be basically a skeleton at this point. I'd be so freaking skinny. Yeah, I should have played for the Horizon 5, but I I got to get this done and over with and out of the way. Got plenty of ways to go, unfortunately. <sighs> Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, 20 years later. It's crazy to think that in two months' time we'll be celebrating the 20th anniversary of this game. Can you believe that? 20 years of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. I still remember the day when they first announced this game. I saw the commercial on TV and I said, I gotta get this game. I bought a PlayStation 2 just to play Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. And Grand Theft Auto 3 and Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Can't forget those either. But mostly San Andreas. Like, when I got San Andreas, oh man, I played this game from like sun up to sun down. I beat it in about a week. The first time I ever played it, I beat the game in literally a, an entire week. Like, I just binged play it. And then when I beat it, I went back and started a new game and beat it some more. <laughs> I've beaten this game on PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, PC. I'm pretty sure I could beat this game on Android if I really wanted to. But I want to beat it on Xbox. And no, I don't have the definitive trilogy version of San Andreas. I could get that and play it, but I, I think I'll just stick with this. I think I'll just stick with this one. My max health is going up. That's good. My lung capacity is going up a little bit. Nice. Let's keep going. Let's see if we can make it all the way to the Golden Gate Bridge. If you do click on this video and you watch this video start to finish and you manage not to get bored, God bless you. Plane flying overhead. Hmm. Go on now. Sometimes in this game there will be a plane that spawns out of nowhere that will crash. I've actually had it happen to me a few times where I'd be doing a mission and a plane spawns out of the sky and crashes and lands right on top of me and blows my vehicle up and kills me. 
It has happened a few times. It's extremely rare, but it can happen. And there's a chance it could happen in this game when I do a mission in the future. There's a strong possible. Well, I take that back. A small possibility. But not impossible. It's not impossible. There's a small possibility that, yes, I could get hit by a plane in the sky. Alright. I gotta get this lung capacity all the way up. Come on, CJ. Swim, buddy. Swim. <gasps> Something's going on up there. Stamina upgraded. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for longer. Nice. Going up quite a bit. Ooh, somebody got a speedboat. They cruising. Better a speedboat than a yacht. A yacht full of silver plaques. My lung capacity is going up just a little bit more. I could be doing literally anything else right now, but no, I gotta learn how to swim, because woozy requires it. I like you, woozy. I don't like this part. This is one of the few parts of San Andreas I really don't fucking like. This might actually be my most hated part of San Andreas. I actually hate this more than doing the zero mission. Like if I had to choose between doing zero's missions all over again or this, I would choose zero's missions. And I don't like zero's missions, but I'd rather do them over this. Hell no, in my luck, I'm probably going to have to make a part two to this. Learning how to swim, part two. Come on, CJ! I'm losing a bit of muscle. Damn it. That's the sacrifice I have to make in order to learn how to swim. Stamina is going up a bit more. Ooh. 
Right back down. Just dive down over and over and over and over and over again. <gasps> right in front of the Golden Gate Bridge. My lung capacity is going up. Nice. Swim past this boat or ship, basically. I'm losing more muscle. get my lung whoa what is going on with the texture down here <gasps> golden gate bridge right in front of me Stamina upgraded. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for longer. Nice. I gotta reach a certain amount before I'm able to do the next woozy mission. Lung capacity upgrade. You can hold your breath for longer. Anyways, how was uh, your days today, ladies and gentlemen? I would say I had a pretty damn good day. Narissa Ravencroft 3D debut. I got to talk to my friend Orbital Sigma again. I mean, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. Not everything is perfect. I mean, Minato Aqua of Hollow Life is unfortunately graduating on the 28th, which is making not just me, but a whole bunch of people in the VTuber industry upset. 
I wish her the very best of luck wherever she goes. If she decides to come back at the Indy, I wish her the very best of luck. We'll see what she does, though, when she's out. Uni. Xbox Game DVR is still having issues even to this day. Even though Xbox has said, we're working on a solution. Yeah, your solution hasn't done jack shit. I see where your priorities lie. You care more about Game Pass Ultimate than you do fixing issues with your consoles. Thanks, Phil. Really appreciate it. I'm getting fucking bored. But I have to do this. I don't have a choice. I have to do this. There is no texture there. That looks really weird. Stamina's going up some more. Come on, CJ. Nope, I'm not gonna make it. Not gonna make it to the ocean floor. Uh oh. Okay, that was a close one. That is a very deep drop off. I'm losing more muscle. All right, head back up. Weather's been pretty brutal where I live too. Been nothing but just hot weather all the time. It hasn't rained here where I live in quite some time. I mean, we're basically in a little bit of a drought right now because it, it hasn't rained in a while. It's been consistently around 100 degrees as of late. Like every single day is consistently around 100 degrees. Sometimes even above 100 degrees. Stamina upgraded. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for longer. Nice.
going up though into this video god bless you i'm gonna title this video this is I i'm gonna title this video don't watch unless you want to get seriously bored because this is really boring and i'm getting bored and i was already a little tired before i recorded this now i'm feeling really tired I should have did this in my spare time. I really should have. I should have done all this in my spare time. Oh well. Might as well do it now. DJ. Losing more muscle, unfortunately. some more Okay, just checking my tablet. If you hear a weird sound in the background, it's probably going to be something uh, from my tablet, a notification most likely. Capacity is going up some more. Alright. Got a speedboat right in front of me. But I'm not going to use it. Sorry, Mr. or Mrs. Speedboat. 
Losing more muscle. Thanks, Woozy. Really appreciate this. is going up. Start doing diving exercises here. Hello, people on the land. Alright. You can now sprint, swim, and cycle for longer. This is probably going to take an entire hour, like I said. Losing more muscle. Lung capacity upgrade. You can hold your breath for longer. Uh-oh, jellyfish. Or there was a mod on PC that made the uh, jellyfish actually hurt you. I could have swore there was a mod for PC, but that's only for the PC version. Moving. 
using more muscle. much halfway. I'll go a little bit more though. And you know, I might actually just say screw it and record for the Horizon 5 tonight. It's really late and I'm gonna get tired. Um, I'm gonna get really freaking tired, but I might as well just get it out of the damn way. In case you don't know how I'm doing these Let's Plays, I'm doing them in alphabetical order. So Forza Horizon 4, Forza Horizon 5, San Andreas. I was doing NASCAR before MX Unleashed, but I'm going to switch that around and do MX Unleashed before NASCAR, then NASCAR, and then Perfect Dark. And then for my story mode Let's Plays, Gears of War, Bowdy and Tony, Lost and Damned, and The Last of Us Part 2. Usually it'll be in alphabetical order. close to the golf course here and it's raining in game of oh course <gasps> Lung capacity is going up some more, and I'm losing more muscle. Alright, I should be good on lung capacity. I should be good enough. Let me go back and manual save my game. And I'm gonna go and see if I can trigger that mission. Uh oh. Hey Caesar, the Yay leave a San Fierro, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ. They go cross country. Uh, okay, sure. Let's see what I can dig up. All right. I mean, I might as well. Ow. I guess I can title this video, Almost Nothing Literally Happens. I mean, I guess this is something interesting. Master sound, thank 
too far. playing on the radio is one of the most meme songs of all time. I've heard this song used in so many memes and stuff. Oh, 
to go, but we're back at Fancy Arrow. You are starting to feel hungry and starting to lose energy. You need to find something to eat. Uh oh. I need to get some food. Alright, I'm back in San Fierro long though. Thank you very much. both of them because even if this doesn't record I didn't really do anything in this video outside of just grind up enough to be able to do the next story mission for Luigi. I'm on my way to see if it'll trigger now. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do the actual mission now but I just want to see if the cutscene will trigger or if I gotta grind out some more. I should be fine now. Hello. Oh, I gotta come back between 20 and 6. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be good to go though. So let me manual save my game again. Good, 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 good. Alright. Thank 
God, although that took almost an hour of fucking boredom, I got it done and over with. I'll be able to do this mission next time I play San Andreas. I'm terribly sorry for this really long and boring San Andreas video. If you made it all the way to the end, God bless you. But that's going to do it here for this video, San Andreas. And that's going to do it here for me tonight. I was going to hop on and play Forza Horizon 5, but it's too late. I I'm just going to head to bed. Thank you all so much for watching. Ed Runner Gaming HD signing out. Peace. Stay safe. Have a great rest of the day or night. Stay hydrated. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. Oh, what a boring San Andreas video. Next week will hopefully be a lot better. I couldn't wait for you to come and clear the cupboard. But now you're gone and leaving nothing but a sign. Another evening I'll be sitting reading in between your lines. Because I miss you all the time. So. Stop!